Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Chemical Engineering Project. Here we will discuss about the divisibility of gas A and gas B. So, in the previous lecture we have discussed about the Chapman and Scope equation to define the divisibility of one gas and the other gas. This equation we will, in this lecture we will discuss about the Fuller equation. It is an empirical equation, Fuller equation to define the divisibility of gas A through the gas B. So, this equation is used to define, to determine the divisivity of gas A into gas B. So, here in this equation, this is a, an empirical equation, in this equation we are going to determine the divisivity of one gas, gas A, and the other gas which is gas B. So, there are two gases, one gas is, one gas, suppose one gas is, uh, suppose one gas is oxygen, suppose this is oxygen gas, and this is the benzene molecule. So the oxygen is diffusing or going through the benzene molecule. So what will be the divisibility of oxygen in the benzene? So this is oxygen and this one is the B is the benzene. So this is the oxygen this one and this one is the so, we will determine this divisivity by using the Fuller empirical equation. Now, the Fuller equation is, this one is the Fuller equation. The divisivity of gas A through gas B is equal to 0 0.00143 and to temperature to the power 1.75 divided by P and AB to the power 1 divided by 2 and to uh, summation of VA. Uh, to the power 1 divided by 3 plus summation of Vb to the power 1 divided by 3 and whole to the power 2. So, this is the Fuller equation. Now, in this Fuller equation, the pressure is in atm. The temperature is in K1. The Dab unit of Dab from this equation is centimeter square per second. So, Unit of it is in centimeter square per second. So the divisivity is in centimeter square per second. Now, from the above equation, the Ma and the Mb, the molecular weight of gas A is Ma and the molecular weight of gas B is Mb. And the unit of molecular mass or molecular weight is gram per mole. The summation Ev mean that the summation of atomic and structural diffusion volume. So E V mean the atomic diffusion volume, atomic diffusion volume, atomic diffusion, diffusion volume. So it is the summation of atomic diffusion volume or it can be the summation of molecular diffusion volume, summation of molecular diffusion volume. So thus this means that the summation of atomic and uh, structural diffusion volume. So, it is the summation of atomic volume, atomic diffusion volume or it can be molecular diffusion volume. The structural diffusion can be also the summation of structural diffusion volume for the structural compound like uh, hexane, hexane it can be uh, C5, H10, tin 10 or it can be for benzene for structural molecule, structural diffusion volume will be used for structural compound. So, now this is the Fuller equation. Now, this is, a, this, there is an example. This, this example, we will solve an example uh, from which we can determine the diffusion, the diffusivity of gas A through gas B. So, this is an example. Uh, determine the diffusivity of gas A in the gas B for oxygen and benzene. So, we are going to determine the diffusivity of oxygen in the benzene molecule. So, the diffusivity of oxygen molecule in the benzene molecule at 38 degree centigrade and 2 atmospheric pressure using the Fuller equation. So, we will use the Fuller equation and we will determine the diffusivity of oxygen molecule through the benzene molecule at 38 degree centigrade and 2 atmospheric pressure by using the Fuller equation. So, what is the Fuller equation? So, there are two components in this 
in the above example there are two component one is uh, oxygen and the other is benzene so two component a plus b two component system are it is a binary system one is oxygen the this is the this is the oxygen molecule o2 and the molecular mass of oxygen is 32 gram per mole b is benzene and uh, this is the benzene molecular formula and the uh, uh, molar mass of benzene is or atomic uh, or the molecular weight of benzene is 78.1 gram per mole the pressure is given to us two atmospheric pressure the temperature is 38 so the, the temperature will be converted to kelvin 38 plus 273.15 that will give us 311.15 kelvin temperature now uh, let's go to fuller equation the fuller equation this is the fuller equation now as we know that the, uh, the, the pressure is in atmospheric so here the pressure is 2 atmospheric pressure so pressure is 2 atmospheric pressure the temperature is the temperature here is 311.311.5 kelvin and we are interested to determine the diffusivity of oxygen in the benzene or we can also determine the diffusivity of benzene through the oxygen because from uh, this polar equation show us that B B A is equal to B A B. So the divisivity of benzene and oxygen will be equal to the divisivity of oxygen in the benzene. So in this case we are going to determine the divisivity of oxygen in the benzene. So now what is this M A B? This is the molecular weight of the mixture. The molecular weight of the binary mixture which is oxygen and benzene oxygen plus benzene the molecular weight of this uh, uh, benzene oxygen mixture which is MAB so in the fuller equation this MAB is unknown to us this MAB is unknown to us so what is this MAB this MAB is equal to this MAB is equal to 2 divided by 1 divided by molecular weight of 1 of component A plus 1 divided by molecular weight of component B so here is component A is oxygen and the component B is the benzene and the mixture molecular weight the unit of mixture molecular weight is gram per mole so uh, 2 divided by when we are plugging uh, uh, quantity a uh, unit in this uh, equation this equation we will get the MAB is equal to 45.4 gram per mole this is for the binary mixture of oxygen and benzene so 44.45.4 gram per mole is the molecular weight of the mixture now what is this EVA this EVA mean EVA what is this mean of this EVA like this one this one this EVA what is this EVA summation of atomic volume similarly the summation of atomic or molecular volume so this EVA the summation of this means that the summation of atomic volume of component A similarly the summation of atomic volume of component A which is oxygen or it can be also we can also say that the summation of molecular diffusion the summation of molecular diffusion so uh, molecular diffusion so the summation of molecular diffusion so here this EVA is the atomic diffusion volume this is the atomic diffusion volume or the molecular diffusion volume summation of this EVA means the summation of molecular or atomic diffusion volume but here in this example there is oxygen molecule so we can say that this EVA means the summation of oxygen diffusion volume so there is we are considering there, there is one type of molecule which is oxygen so this EVA means the summation of oxygen diffusion volume so the oxygen diffusion is for oxygen so oxygen diffusion volume is equal to 16.3 this value is come out from the table 3.1 so the molecular diffusion volume for oxygen is 16.3 this is from table 3.1 now here is the table 3.1 so let's come to table 3.1 table 3.1 this one this is table 3.1 so 
This is the table 3.1 diffusion volume from polar equation and the atomic diffusion volume and the structural diffusion volume. This is the atomic carbon atom. This is hydrogen, oxygen, nitrogen, aromatic ring, heterocyclic ring. So the atomic diffusion volume per carbon is 15.9. Similarly, per hydrogen it is 2.31. Per oxygen it is 6.11. Similarly, per fluorine it is, it is 15.7. Per fluorine, bromine, iodine, sulfur. Similarly, diffusion volume for simple molecule. This is the monoatomic molecule: helium, neon, argon, krypton, xenon, hydrogen, deuterium, nitrogen, oxygen, air. So, here uh, we are interested in the uh, in the oxygen is uh, transferring through the benzene. So, this is the oxygen. This one is the oxygen O2. So, the O2 diffusion volume for the oxygen. Diffusion volume for the oxygen is 16.3. So 16.3. So this is 16.3. We will determine from the table 16.3. Now the diffusion volume for the uh, benzene is the structural ben uh, diffusion volume for the benzene is summation of uh, diffusion volume for the benzene. B is for the benzene. And the summation of diffusion volume for benzene molecule. So B is for benzene component. Benzene is a structural compound. It is also called aromatic compound because it is uh, aromatic. This is aromatic compound. Single uh, M alternate single and double bond. So its molecular uh, formula is C6H6. And the benzene molecule consists of six carbonate, carbon atom, six atom of carbon, and six atom of hydrogen. So the carbon, the atomic diffusion volume for carbon is 15.9 15.9 and the atomic diffusion volume for hydrogen atom is uh, 2.31 2.31 so this hydrogen and this is for carbon so let's carbon and hydrogen the atomic diffusion volume for carbon and hydrogen is uh, we can also obtain from the above table so for carbon and hydrogen this is carbon Atomic diffusion volume is 15.9 for hydrogen, it is 2.31. So, from table 3.1, we can determine the atomic and diffusion volume for the carbon and hydrogen. So, 15.9 we obtained from the table and 2.31. So, combine add these two values, we will get this one. So, the benzene this is 6 carbon, 6 hydrogen, they are. Atomic diffusion volume per carbon is 15.9, per hydrogen it is 2.3. When we combine, we will get this. This is the atomic diffusion volume for the atom of benzene ring, which is aromatic compound. So, but there is uh, a question that the benzene, the benzene is aromatic ring. So, uh, there is a rule that for the aromatic ring, we will, uh, we will, uh, we will, uh, uh, the minus 18 will be we will remove 18.3 value from this value from this value so 6 carbon 6 hydrogen the carbon value is 15.9 hydrogen is 2.31 but for the aromatic ring we will minus 18.3 because it is aromatic ring it is given in the table it is given there is an assumption or there is an uh, this is given in the table if, if they say that for aromatic ring, you, sh you should determine, you should remove 13.3. If the, there is the cyclic ring, then you will get also remove 18.3. So, benzene is aromatic ring, so we will minus 18.3 from our benzene ring to determine the atomic volume for the atom of benzene. So, here we remove. 18.3 value according to the table 3.1. Now come to the same question. This is 6 carbon, 6 hydrogen, and we determine we remove 18.3 according to table 3.1. Table 3.1. So putting the value and minus 18.3, we will get 90.6. So the atomic diffusion volume for the atom of for the atom of benzene benzene ring is 90.96 so now come to the polar equation and putting the value in polar equation so the polar equation is simple equation DAB and this is the 
0.00143 this is from the equation this is the temperature 38 degrees centigrade when we convert it into kilowatt we will get 311.15 and this is to the power 1.75 similarly this is the pressure the pressure was given to us which was 2 atm and this was the uh, mab 45.4 mab we have already determined the mab value in this case mab which is 45 uh, like uh, in the above to determine the MAB value the MAB value this one this one 45.4 so MAB is 45.4 putting 45.4 so we put 45.4 to the power 1 divided by 2 and to uh, summation of atomic volume for the oxygen so summation of the uh, molecular diffusion volume so here we will put the molecular diffusion volume for the oxygen which is 16.3 so for oxygen it was 16.3 here we will obtain the value this one 16.3 the molecular diffusion volume for oxygen similarly uh, similarly this is the this one is the atomic diffusion volume for the atom of benzene molecule the atomic diffusion volume for the benzene atoms which is 90.96 90.96 which we obtain from this this is a 90.96 the atomic diffusion volume 90.96 so putting this value and 16.3 to the power to the power 1 divided by 3 plus 90.6 to the power 1 divided by 3 and whole to the power 2 whole to the power this term 2 there is 1 divided by 3 the power the power 1 divided by 3 here 1 divided by 3 here and this term and on this term and whole term is divided by 2 here there is remember that this is 1 divided by 2 and this this term and 1 divided by 1 and 1.75 is power on this this temperature so when we put after putting the value the uh, divisibility of oxygen in the benzene was determined to be 0 0.0494 cm square per second. So, this is the divisibility of oxygen in benzene at 2 atmospheric pressure and 38 degrees centigrade. Now, we can also suppose this equation, suppose come to this table, uh, this is the gas sphere. Then this is the temperature, this is the diffusivity in centimeter square per second. Experimental diffusivity of gas is pair. So, as air carbon dioxide at this temperature, the diffusivity will be 0 0.1177 centimeter square per second. Similarly, for the uh, oxygen benzene system at 1 atm, we can also determine. So, here these are various cases like we can oxygen water. The visibility of oxygen and water at uh, 253 Kelvin temperature is this one. So, this is the one atmospheric pressure. At one atmospheric pressure, it is is one atm, and one atm is oxygen, and the other atom, uh, the other one molecule is oxygen, the other is suppose water. So, the visibility of oxygen in water at one atmospheric pressure and when temperature is. Uh, 353 352.3 kilowatt so the divisivity will be 0 0.352 centimeter square per second so this is very important table you can also determine the divisivity of one gases through another gases from this table this is very important table so thank you very much for your attention